Hello everyone, this is Unretired, and today we'll be talking about crafting. Now, crafting in the repopulation is a huge endeavor. If you are a Star Wars Galaxy veteran player, you know absolutely what I am speaking of. Alright, now let's just go through the basics. Um, for those that don't have the game, uh, for those that do have the game, um, <laughs> it does take a lot of time to get used to the crafting system. Uh, because there's so just so much you need so many items you need to go gather You'll be at your crafting station for s huge amounts of time uh, This is if you want to do crafting at all, right, but I'm willing to bet everybody's gonna want to do crafting because it's one of the most interesting things in the rep repopulation now that being said let's go take a look uh, so if you press R on the keyboard you'll see all of these let's just put this here the pet things here so uh you'll see all um different kinds of professions uh harbor crafting artillery carpentry well, carpentry is what i am doing that's going to be my specialization um chemistry cosmetics etc etc now take it take it into consideration that Let's say if you are doing armor crafting, for sure you will be uh, going into metalworking, mining, and so on and so forth. Every profession is linked to another profession. There's no going around that, just just so you know already. Now, um, I'm just going to show you really quick how the crafting works. So I've already picked up some mine. I've already gotten some items. I am in the workshop in town, and let's just go here just uh, for the purpose of this. Now, I'll just show you something from genetic engineering. It's probably one of the easiest professions in the game, and we'll be doing biomass uh, reclamation and clone species. So basically, genetic engineering is your genetically engineering um, mobs that are outside. Just uh, like this set line here. Although I tamed that, you can get a genetically and uh, genetically uh, engineered version of this one. Okay, so as you can see here, if I click on biomass reclamation, it says that I need two of tissue samples and sterilization agents. Now, sometimes the uh, the agents that you need in the recipes are sold from the vendor. And sometimes they're not sold from the vendor. There will be items that you need to craft in game for you to, to use into the into the recipe. So I got the ten, uh, ten sterilization agents. I thought that it would be enough. So if you want to know where it is, it's from this guy in FP in Freedom Town. I'm from FPR, although I am rogue. I'll make another video regarding that as well, uh, just for everybody. So basically, we go down, and you, as you can see, there's so many agents, refining agents. Uh, you know, salt, sandpaper, and whatnot. Okay, but what we want is sterilization agents. So I bought 10, and there are 10, so that's 100 gold. All right, so once you got your steri sterilization agents, or whatever you needed to buy, doesn't really matter, we go here and we'll double click, double left, uh, left click, and you'll have this woman that pops up. Now let's explain what the window is. So you'll have your d uh, difficulty, which would be simple, normal, and I believe there's another tier I haven't reached that as of yet, but I know they're simple and normal. Um, simple is basically, I would say, when you're starting off, you're just not really caring about the quality of your items. You just want to scale up as much as possible. Once you actually reach um, a recipe that that you can have normal, because not every recipe has no, uh, normal difficulty, okay? Let's get that out of the way. Some some do have normal and most have simple. So let's say we have normal. What what what's that difference? Well, the only difference is that um, the result will be lower, but you'll be skilling up much faster. So once you've reached at a certain point, you'll you'll be hitting a roadblock after a certain point in leveling um, a certain skill that you'll need to put normal just to get more skills unless you're using really high quality um, uh, items such as A quality because your, your quality goes from F O to A grades 
okay F being like bad just like you know when you get um, the grade F in school and A which is really great just like in school all right let's that's pretty easy to understand all right so um, let's do this recipe and we'll um, do it step by step so you can either double click like this and the tissue sample will come up or you can shift click right there and get it and as you can see as soon as I put the item here you'll see the result so I would be getting three uh, biomass if you wonder how I did that right here the, to get the little window I right click on the result item and this is what I got so pure cellular tissue ready to be used to create new life that's great and it would be F quality as is right now uh, and this really depends how far you've leveled that recipe the long the the more skill you have in the recipe the better quality you'll have you'll have as a result the better the recipe and the items that you're using the better quality of the result again so all depends on it all depends on you and how what you want to put in and what you're gonna get out of it all right so let's just put our sterilization agent and for purposes well let's do start by process so I would do process so I'd have one step one F6 step two D2 and third step I got right to D8 and it came out so right as you can see went into my uh, bank uh, inventory and I have three biomass of D8 quality now uh, you'll have the option of batch and all so I just do all here and you finish yeah, I'll keep getting like that and protect like everyone. that and we're done right we don't have any more sterilization agent it doesn't really make a difference now you'll have the option for certain recipes to do batch um, most people in the game will not suggest doing batch because you're taking such a huge amount of uh, materials um, agents uh, your actual ingredients you're taking a r more of that and you're not really getting any quality out of it you're just you just want to pump the items out you just want to pump those results out really quick um, it's not advised to do although some people will do it just to get just to pump out some like crappy quality items and they'll put it on the auction house but I'm saying don't do it you can try it once and see how it goes but you'll be kind of wasting your time you'll be like you're like oh wow I've kind of like just wasted all my items for absolutely no reason which you don't want to do because your time you know in real life time is money well you know in this game you'll be spending a lot of time in it doing this crafting so don't waste your time I'll be invincible. perfect um, now another thing I could tell you about crafting is you can actually let's say we're here I can right click on it and it'll come up into the game database. Game database um, is your best friend, basically. It is your best friend. You can see what tissue sample is, and from all of the different mobs, enemies that you can get the tissues from. And you can go back, you can see what the sterilization agent is, and you can just get the sterilization agent that I got from the vendor, or you can make your own agents if you wish. All right. And you can see from uh, where they're actually used. So, sterilization agent for genetically genetic engineering is right here. You have biomass reclamation, and you have your prion disease sterilization. So let's, for example, just click here. It'll tell you what you need: tissue sample, sterilization agent, and it gives you your biomass. Very easy to understand. Now, what if you get an item and you wonder what it is for crafting? Go into item and type up like let's say let's say glue. Okay, there's two different kinds of glue. Let's say I click on glue. You'll see it'll tell you what kind of component it is. This it's a bonding agent. How can I get it? Well, through destru destructive distillation softwood. For logging, I click on it. You know you need softwood. What kind of softwood do you need? Well, here you can actually see it. You'll need a heat source and dist distilled water as well. But you can see with the glue that you need Hudson fur, fear, sorry, fur, fur, hard to say. <laughs> All right, so you'll need this to get glue, uh, mapery to turpine, and so on and so forth. All right, so if you're really interested in um, knowing what kind of materials off bat that you'll need, that is your best friend. All right, it'll be able to show you 
on the map where every where everything is uh, I'll just show you that right away so in subsistence uh, you can see deposit fish deposits a uh, humanoid all monsters plants uh, ro robots trees so let's say it was a Hudson fur it'll show you the area difficulty of the area the count time count and uh, how it replenishes all right so use this very wisely it is your best friend and don't be shy to ask in, in game chat as well so let's get back to the actual crafting so we'll go into clone species so like, like before we'll be doing the same thing now we need here is your biomass which we've actually crafted from biomass reclamation and we need primary DNA so for the purpose of the video I already got primary DNA but if you'd like let's say you're, you're new to the game you right click on it and you can see all the DNAs that are available for this re specific recipe okay so let's just click here and you can see the result already clone vulture so you can either do process one two three and you're finished or you can do all and it'll just go up like that perfect so that resulted in four clone vultures and as you can see in the stack I got one of d5 two of d4 and one of d1 and if you want to separate it shift like that and there you go I've separated my three um, qualities and if you want to compress it back together okay, just put it back oh. I don't know why that's doing that. It's kind of weird. But anyways, so yeah, that's um, the basics of crafting. There are so many other things uh, that are advanced that I could show you guys, but that should be more for another video. Um, if you want to see a certain kind of crafting and the items from A to Z, what you need, from which recipe, from which um, profession you'll need to get those items, uh, Put a leave a comment and I'll look into it and see what I can do for you. Uh, I do have the intention of making other videos for most professions. It just that it's very time consuming, takes a lot of time to gather everything. So yeah, it could take some time. But leave a comment and if you like the video. Obviously, um, tell me what you'd like to see more of for crafting, and I'll definitely accommodate everyone. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed the video guys. It's a basic video for people that might not be in the game yet or are in the game but need a bit more help. And that's about it. So I'll see you guys in the next video. See you.